Pog. Where are the giant bags of popcorn? Again? I guess they're gone. Anyway. Oh, I'm sorry. I just smacked inside of your guys' ears. Give me a second. Let me chew this. Okay, and we're back. Sorry about that, guys. I wanted to wanted to eat something, but I didn't want to eat it like in your guys' face. So now getting right into it, uh, SD Sandy versus Gohan. Uh, we're not going to discuss what SD stands for, so um, don't even ask. Getting right into it, Gohan actually losing his first stock. Couple jabs there, just trying to. Trying to catch what his tech situation is. Nope, decided to actually tech inward instead of actually teching in place. As there's the <laughs> there's the fireball actually gonna gimp him, and now the up B unable to make it. Down throw, up air, up air, no jump here. Not able to take full advantage. There's another up air into the up smash. Uh oh, here comes Gohan actually working on quite the comeback here. Oh, there it is. SD Sandy actually able to get the spot dodge into the jab, Nair into the forward tilt. Downer, not really gonna get it just yet. Ooh, great parry there from Gohan and great punish. He's still going. Uppers into the downer. Fireball, not gonna give him the stun. Ooh, a smash. Still not gonna do it just yet. Both these players just trying to find their little pokes in each other's defenses. Oh my goodness, all of them. <laughs> Throughout the same move and end up getting the same animation, but the up smash here from Gohan actually able to take it. Come up air is not really going to do it. The forward smash with a with a slight taste of a hail mary in that one. SD Sandy might have to be start looking for some sort of a way out. Another forwarder not really going to get it. another up smash and another up smash. The spot dodge into the up tilt. I feel like an up smash actually would have worked there, and I think he just got a little bit too excited and actually just flipped the stick wrong. Up B, out of the combo, able to just survive just a little bit more, but now we have Gohan with the slight amount of rage. Actually, full rage. It's 160. What am I talking about? It's a Nair out of shield. Another Nair, not really going to get it. Up smash, nope, still not enough. There's forward smash, catching the landing there on the back air, and that is going to do it. Exclamation point, up time coming in. Uh, up time about um about 45 minutes. It's currently 8:44. The stream did go live when the bracket went live. So by that logic, it is currently 8:44 p.m. Downer to the up air. Ooh, catching catching the backer there on his uh, drift op drifting option. Down till actually gonna attack, attack on a little bit more damage. 94%. Both of these players once again just trying to find any sort of a poke in each other's defenses, potentially with Nair, or maybe even a rant, maybe even a Hail Mary forward smash or a Hail Mary up smash. Oop, there it is, there's the forward smash. The forward throw. Not gonna get it just yet. Trying to get the fireball hung on a little bit too long and eats the down smash for his trouble. Oh, and it turns out that uh, Gohan was the one wearing the American flag. Um, Vance, can I get a up, can I get an update on who's who? <laughs> can I get an update on on uh, who's who? Because you changed it halfway through. Hello, Vance. Help, help. I 
I guess we're not getting help on this one. Alright. I'm sure fans got the update, so we'll just see how it goes down. So now we're going to Town and City. A uh, very big stage. Um, obviously, these two like to play around each other's defenses. Yes, can confirm SD Sandy actually did win game number one. So I apologize for all of the misnames in game number one. Um, fortunately, I have no control over the stream. So I apologize again. All right, let's back here into the Nair. SD Sandy definitely just poking through. Gohan going for the Tomahawk and SD Sanjay seeing straight through that. Up air, cover for up air is not coming out from Gohan. Easy jab. He's going to go way low for that one. That actually thought he caught a second jump. And in fact, did not. So now there's the flood. Extra edge guard opportunity is Gohan going in for the, the beautiful backer. And he's actually going to take it. There's the keep. Oh my goodness. He can do it again. No. Great tech there from Gohan. Gohan seems to have woken up. Oh, they're up there into the landing there. Not really going to do it just yet. Both of them just jumping with, <laughs> jumping with their backs towards each other. Just knowing that that is our best move. Oh, be actually reaching through the platform. Oh, once again, it was actually hit him with the backer there. Another couple landing backers trying to get the up. Oh my goodness! Both of them are smashing at the same time. Great minds think alike. Oh, down throw? Yep, it was a down throw. Trying to get the di mix up. It would have be not going to do it just yet. Oh, there's the smash. Going to hit the shield. The forward tilt out of shield. Ooh, great up tilt into the up air. Still not enough. Town and city with a very, very high ceiling. Even with rage. Oh, oh. Let, he let go. Trying to hit fireball. I'm guessing what he tried to do. He tried to let go of shield. He tried to let go of ledge. Tried to short hop onto the stage. And I guess he just did the input a little bit too fast. And actually just end up eating the initial jump input. So... Unfortunate stuff, it happens a lot. There's, there's the back air, and that's going to do it. It's now Gohan. Showing some signs of life here. A couple more jabs there into the forward tilt. Not really going to be doing much. No, not much of a conversion out of that. Gohan actually ended up going out for the forward air. Just kind of a Hail Mary pass on that end. So, up air? No, not up. Back right into the down air as Andrew Gohan ends up hitting him with the Nair. So now SD Sandy, not much options here. Here at the ledge, Gohan, great patience there. Just not really going to think too much as to like what he wants to do. There's the back throw. Still not going to do it. Still not going to do it. Sitting on the platform. Sandy had the right idea, but Andrew just didn't hit it. Up smash still not gonna be enough. We on town and city. We ain't dying early. Up till actually getting stuffed out there by the jabs. A couple more back is still not enough as Gohan able to sneak under that and get the up smash. So now we have ourselves a game three. Gohan was a little overwhelmed in game number one. SD Sandy throwing out, throwing out a lot of options and Gohan getting a little bit too uh overwhelmed and then suddenly Gohan had a little bit more room to work with and was actually able to bring that back so it's not going forward game three I believe they decided to go to Pokemon Stadium 2 um, obviously Sandy looking for the platforms to uh, to extend his combos to the city a little bit too inconsistent in terms of platforms change scene there we go Like an internet historian video. <laughs> Scene transition. Oh, down toe, down toe, up air. Oh, there's the cape. Just trying to do anything he can to get Gohan off of him. Looking a little bit too overwhelmed here. Up air, up air. Oh, what is he going to do? Another up air? Into the back air. And Gohan now with the, ooh, Getting a little bit ballsy here with that forward air. All right, I see you, Gohan. 
Dash attack. The extra balls. Yes, D Sandy actually just playing the dash away game. Just gonna wait for him to throw out his landing option and able to punish it. Back throws. Obviously not gonna be enough at this point. This is Sandy with the wall of back airs. Dash attack going to catch him with the and catch him off his inbound frames. There's another air dodge, and he's able to up you right back to the stage. So now just back against the wall. Gohan able to fight back. There's another backer. Double jump backer? No, still not going to be enough. Trying to get the ledge jump backer. Not going to do it just yet. I probably said backer more times right now than I have the entire set. There's a forward smash there from Gohan, actually able to take Sandy's first stock. Up smash, another up smash. Is that going to be enough? Yes, it is. Sorry about that. I, I I don't have game audio, so when they die off the top, it just goes past the hat logo, and I don't know if they're like still in the air or the dead. Oh, there's the up B. Oh, got the cape, and he was still able to grab ledge anyway. Smart thinking there from Sandy. Not really able to get much out of it, though. Couple more up airs. Up air. Ooh, wanted the air dodge into something else, but he wasn't able to get it. Go down to his air dodging away. That's a lot of lag. Ooh, flood not coming into play as now SD Sandy has a stage control. And with one back air, it now goes back into Gohan's favor. Up air. Up air. in there into the forward smash. You're really not going to get much out of it. Go on there. Big and easy backer. There's the back throw at the ledge. Yes, that's going to do it. 127%. That is definitely going to do it, especially with the little bit of little bit of rage that Gohan had at 85. A couple more backers. There's the down air out of shield. Able to actually combo this. Oh my goodness. Calling out the landing there. There from Sandy. Oh, and unable to actually get anything more out of it. Sandy now sitting at 59% on his final stock. Five minutes left on the clock. As Gohan can now take his sweet, sweet time. That throw. Not really going to do it. Misty Sandy here throwing out a lot of uh, dash attacks here at the ledge. And that is actually going to do it. Catching the double jump off the ledge with the backer. So now Sandy has a chance to actually make a comeback here. Very volatile matchup this can be. Down throw, up air, up air. Oh, he wanted to get a little bit more out of it. Thought he was going to land on him so he can get the up tilt into, into a, a longer extended combo. Still unable to do it. There's the cape into the up air. That was bizarre. But we'll allow it anyway. Oh, there's the up tilt there. Catching the air dodges now. Gohan has him on the ropes. SD Sandy still fighting back though. Dash check. Still not going to do it. Oh, went for the double jump backer. The up B. Not going to do it just yet. Drop zone backer. Not double jump. Sorry about that. Quick little fireball. A little bit more fireballs. Getting a little bit too risky with them, though. Sandy's going to start adjusting. Actually able to punish them. Time to go for full hop Nair and just following him through his roll. A couple of uppers there. Sandy wanted the grab and actually inputs the pivot grab by mistake. Another dash away forward smash. Now we're getting into some dangerous percentage here to where a, a raw forward smash can actually do it. As there's the up air there, just put so much pressure onto Sandy and force him to do something risky. And that is going to be his demise. Gohan taking it 2-1. Here, winner's round three, able to punch his ticket into winner's quarter.